CAT 2021 slot 2 quantitative aptitude question number 4 from a container filled with milk 9 liters of milk are withdrawn and replaced with water next from the same container 9 liters are withdrawn again and replaced with water if the volumes of milk and water in the container are now in the ratio of 16 is to 9 then the capacity of the container in liter is now this is your question okay now this is a standard question really Suppose we have a container full of milk, let's say x liter of milk. So if you look at, the, if you record the volumes of milk and water at the end of each such replacement, initially the volume of milk is x, the volume of water is 0. When you withdraw 9 liters, the volume of milk will be x minus 9 and when you are replacing it by 9 liters of water, so the volume of water will be 9. Now when you re withdraw 9 liters again, so basically what happens? 9 by x fraction of milk goes out because you are withdrawing 9 out of x total volume. So milk left, this is at the end of first iteration, this is at the end of the second iteration milk left after the second such iteration will be x minus 9 minus the milk that goes out and what is the milk that goes out parts of milk into x minus 9 you take x minus 9 common so x minus 9 into 1 minus 9 by x which is x minus 9 square upon x so this is the milk left at the end of second operation this is milk left. So can we say that milk left upon the original quantity of milk, milk left upon original quantity of milk must be equal to x minus 9 whole square upon x upon the original quantity of milk which is x. So I can write the whole of this as x minus 9 upon x whole square. And what is the ratio of milk and water? 6 is to 9. Because initially there was milk only. Therefore, the ratio of milk and initial quantity of milk can also be equal to the ratio of milk remaining upon the total quantity of mixture that is 25. So if you simplify this, you can take the square root on the two sides. You will get this is equal to 4 by 5. 4x, x is equal to 45, x is equal to 45. So I hope you are able to understand how the value of initial capacity of the vessel is equal to 45.